to least for today's video is going to be a makeup tutorial on this look I'm wearing right now. Um, I don't know what I'm calling it yet, but I'm pretty sure I might base it off the lipstick I'm wearing. This is Jeffree Star Daddy Lipstick, just in case you didn't want to wait. <laughs> so if you want to find out how I created this look, then just keep on watching the video. Alright, starting off with my brows, I'm going to use my BH Cosmetics brow pomade in shade brunette as bloody always on a v10 brush by bh cosmetics also and i'm just filling them in this is real time this video is not sped up by the way so um so yes there is a lovely brow check it out carving it out with the maybelline master conceal concealer on another bh cosmetics synthetic flat concealer brush oh that's a mouthful and i'm just going to carve out my brow and then bring down the concealer to use as an eyeshadow primer Okay, so that's what I was singing. I was singing uh, Swallow. Yes, so that's a good song. If you haven't heard it, definitely go listen to it. Anyway, then I'm going to take my Bare Minerals Powder, and this is translucent, and I'm just going to whack it on my eyes. I'm going to take my Huda Beauty Textured Rose Gold Palette, and I'm going to take a Bare Cosmetics 101 brush, and I'm going to use the color Shy, and whack that in the crease. This is the first time I ever used this color, and I thought it was going to be a lot more pink, but it turned out to be a lot more red, which I'm into red and oranges right now, so not a problem. Taking an Anastasia brush, and taking the color Henna, I'm going to basically just go right over that just because I saw that it came out a lot red so I was like you know what let's do red then so of course I'm going to take my favorite color in the whole palette which is henna and ba literally going over that shy color because we're just building and intensifying color layer by layer I'm going to take the color man eater which is this beautiful bright red shade and I'm just going to take the smallest amount and just take it on my outer V and then taking what's left and putting it on the inner corner of my eye. Now I just missed what the color that was but I have a feeling it might have been cocoa or bossy and I'm going to use that on the outer section and then just kind of diffuse in the middle. Then I'm just going to take a clean brush. This is not clean but you know I didn't dip into anything and just blend it together. Then using my finger and taking the rose gold color I'm just going to rub it on and then I'm going to take the next color which is called trust fund and blend it on as well. There it is, Trez Trust Fund. I was a bit ahead of myself there. And I like to use my uh, finger using these because that's the way you're supposed to. <laughs> it says it on the box. And then I'm just using Maybelline Hyper Glossy to create my signature release with beauty wings. For mascara, I'm going to use Revlon Lash Potion. And then I'm going to take my favorite lashes in D105s from Dodo Lashes and just apply those using some Velour Lashes uh, uh, Lash Glue. Now moving on to face, I'm going to take my MAC Prep and Prime uh, Primer and just rub that all over my face. And then I'm going to take my Kryolan Concealer Wheel and cancel out any redness on my face and prime my nose so my foundation stays on my nose all day. And I'm also going to then literally put it everywhere on all rednesses rednesses that's not a word and then take the orange concealer and uh take away those dark circles and bounce that in with a booty blender as patrick star would say kind of stealing from him <laughs> now i'm going to take my mac foundation i can't remember what this one is i think it's like select spf 15 maybe i don't know probably not it's not studio fix that's for sure and i'm just going to take that on an echo flat top kabuki brush and just buff that into the skin Going back in with the Maybelline Master Conceal and the same brush from BH Cosmetics, I'm just going to apply some concealer in triangle shapes under my no under my nose, under my eyes, then apply it to the bridge of my nose, the forehead, the cupid's bow, and the chin. I believe I even do it on the sides of my face, maybe? Like where the contour goes? I don't know. Yes, I did. <laughs> and then just bounce that in with the booty blender. <laughs> it doesn't sound the same as the way Patrick does it. <laughs> And then setting that with the bare, nope, the bare minerals translucent powder we used before, but I just kind of like scratched it with my finger so it wouldn't, it wasn't pressed, it was loose because I'm out of translucent powder right now. Don't worry, I just bought some. <laughs> but yes, that is what I'm doing. Okay, moving on. And then I'm just going to take some and dust it all over my face as well because we need to set the face in place. 
Then I'm going to go back in with all the colours we used before. So we're going to use Shy and Henna and Sandalwood. I don't think we used Sandalwood before, but I definitely just dipped into it. And then I'm just going to run that under my lower lash line on a pencil brush. And then take that Bossy colour or Cocoa, can't remember which one. And run that on a fluffy brush to deepen it up. Taking Star Wars CoverGirl Super Size Lap Mascara and putting that on my lower lash line. This is going really fast now. I'm going to contour with Benefit Hula Bronzer on an Eka Flat brush. I don't know what this is. It doesn't have a number. I'm also just going to take a fan brush and contour my nose just a tiny bit and blend that out with a stippling brush by Real Techniques. I got a Real um, Techniques um, stippling brush because my other one, when I was washing it, just completely the bristles just like fell out. I was like, okay. <laughs> now I'm going to take the angled brush from the Eka as well on my favorite blush of all time, Coral Easter. Now for the most exciting part ever, I am taking the Jeffree Star Eclipse Highlighter, which is the collab with Manny MUA. I'm obsessed with this stuff. It is so good. Look at that. Like, oh my God. Look at my face. Shook to the core. And I'm going to apply that to my, both to my cheeks, my nose, pretty much everywhere. I don't really put highlighter in a specific place anymore. I just kind of like dump it everywhere because I'm obsessed with it. Like, oh my God. Yes. Queen. Ooh. <laughs> um, now I'm going to take the Nicole Guerrero Anastasia um, Glow Kit and I'm going to take the Forever Lit Color. Just put it on the inner corner. Now I'm just going to take some star sequins that I get from the craft store and I'm just going to take some eyelash glue and pop those on my lower lash line. This is my favourite thing to do. A lot of people say that like my eyes look like snake eyes sometimes when I do them but I'm obsessed with it or I look like I have a smudge under my eye but I'm obsessed and I'm no one can tell me what to do. Perry does it so I can too. <laughs> And then I'm going to use Jeffree Star and Manny MUA collaboration uh, lip could lipstick in shade Daddy. This is the most amazing shade. I'm obsessed with it. I haven't stopped wearing it since I got it in the mail. Like, oh my god, literally obsessed. Look at it. Oh my god, yes. And then setting with Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray and this look is complete. So that is it for this video guys, hope you did enjoy it. If you did, please give it a giant thumbs up and make sure you've entered my giveaway. I'll leave it in the end card, um, on the end card. And um, it ends in a month and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. If you